This week, you can see a world-renowned African musician and help children from across the globe. Here with me today is Emily and Quinn to tell us about how you can join in and support all of this and hear some good music at the same time, right? Absolutely. Some of my favorite musicians in the globe. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's incredible to be able to have them here in Grand Rapids. The one coming up this Thursday, Fatumata Jawara. Uh, she's touring the U.S. only playing six cities yeah. and uh, you know, they're major cities, New York, Boston, Chicago, mm -hmm. and, and coming to Grand, Grand Rapids. Rapids. Grand Rapids. You know? To the listening room, yeah. which is such a unique experience right. when you go to see an artist there. She's a modern day storyteller and an incredibly vivacious, strong, powerful performer to see her in a space that's set for like 200 people and that kind of intimacy with great acoustics. It's going to blow people away. It's amazing. Yeah, yeah we yeah. designed this place. It's, it's small, intimate, uh, almost has this kind of jazz club kind of feel, dark, yeah. low lit. There's servers <laughs> walking around bringing yeah. drinks. But then when the show starts, we really focused on the, the stage is right there in front of you, the audio. There's not a bad seat in the house visually or listening wise. And uh, it, the show takes over and you, you, get, you get something really unique and special. You feel immersed in it, mm -hmm. completely immersed in the experience that's happening, which I think is what's the best thing about the listening room yeah. for sure. Yeah. And also it's going to be benefiting um, schools for Sierra Leone. Yes. Yeah, this is an organization that supports a couple of schools, a school system that's been growing in Kabbalah, Sierra Leone. Uh, it's a school that was started in 2010 after the ten decade long civil war in the country. And it was a situation in which maybe 2% of the students in the country were able to pass the West African standardized exams. And so this school is piloting along with the Ministry of Education in Sierra Leone, some new uh, literacy teaching methodology that has been um, incredibly powerful. About 100% of the students have been graduating oh with goodness. honors, with passing these West African standardized testing. And there's some really exciting things that are happening with that school as a hub for continuing teacher training for schools in the region. Wow, that is a, an amazing accomplishment and that's pretty that's um, wonderful to know that we're able to reach across and help other yeah. students you know, in other parts of the My world. My husband grew up there, so it's personal for our family <laughs> and we get really excited about it. <laughs> um, and then, of course, if you do happen to miss this concert because you can't make it, there's something else coming up too. Yeah, yeah in March we're hosting Ladysmith Black Mombazo, an incredible uh, South African <laughs> a cappella group that uh, you probably know the name, but if you don't, you'd recognize from Paul Simon's Graceland album, the, mm, the yes. Diamonds on the Souls and yes. Shoes and all that. That's <laughs> them that, that did those recordings. Um, and they tour around mm. uh, the country from time to time as well, March 12th and 13th. Mm -hmm. um, there's 13 of them, all a cappella, <laughs> just on our stage. And again, I mean, and we only fit about 200 people in there. So, you yeah. know, it's it's going to be incredible. Yeah. You know? They've won five Grammys. The, this is an extraordinary group, and the opportunity to hear them here is one that we're super excited about. Yeah. I, again, like I, I was telling Quinn on our way in here, I have a personal memory with this band. My dad put the cassette tape for Graceland in our boat. So for three summers running, uh, my experience of boating and water skiing in West Michigan had a uh, Lady Smith Black Mombazo soundtrack to it. And so I'm really eager to hear them in a different right, kind of space, you know. but I have really fond memories connected to that. I love that. It's going to make you feel like summertime and yeah. you're going to know all the words, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, thank you both so much for joining us. Of course, if you would like any information on the show times and dates, we've got that on our website, 13onyourside.com.